Well, trial harvest putting it on for us today. Yeah, been a while, but we're back at the back of the coast. Shorts and t-shirt weather. It's probably the two best <laughs> days we've had in a very long time. Actually, we've uh, yeah, come down from Cradle Mountain. Gorge, making some lunch, and uh, there's a little walk here we're going to do, so that'll be cool. But right next to the river, it is actually a campsite, um, but we're not going to stay here obviously. But found a cracking little spot if we wanted to, but yeah, just going to knock up some kebabs. We've just got the, got the oh, chicken skewers on the on the barbie there, throw them on some wraps with some salad, and can't go wrong with that. Don't mind the airbag pump in the background. Yeah, then we'll do a walk and get moving. So we stopped on the side of the road, we're walking into Wardle Falls. It says, instructions on wiki says, park on the side of the road, walk across, follow the pink ribbons. So coming to start the walk, not exactly that well path. But anyway. We'll hunt for the pink ribbons and see where we end up. It's meant to be pretty spectacular, so it'll be worth the effort, I guess. What do you got us into here, dear? What the hell? Dead set like the land time forgot in here. It's just not really tracked. It doesn't look like anyone's been through here for 150 years. <laughs> the only thing we've got to go off is the bloody little pink ribbons, but pretty spectacular. It's one of those games. What's, what's yeah, that game? Yeah, we found one over here. The anyway. game that you play where you have to find things. Where's your mouth? Um, orienteering, is that where you yeah. go on orienteering? Yeah. But you know, yeah, <laughs> we'll uh, keep hunting down these pink ribbons and see where we end up. It's a bit of a walk. I don't know if you can, probably doesn't give it any sort of perspective. <laughs> Got a steep old little climb down here to get to the bottom of the falls, but and I'm sure we'll manage. But yeah, if you're not very light of foot or have any walking armors, I don't suggest this one, but anyway, let's hit it. Coast, um, as Hayley said, Trial Harbour. Uh, 
lady up in Zihan told us to come down here. She's got a little cabin up here actually that she said we could camp on a block, but we've camped on the top here. But uh, yeah, the weather's turning on and boys are getting wet and yeah. might do some fishing, but yeah. Another nice day tomorrow, so we might hang around as well tomorrow. Yeah, we've uh, don't know how long we're gonna stay here, but yeah, good to be back at the, back at the salt water. So anyway, we're gonna check it out and show you some footage of the little area we've got up there. Checking around the beach here, just found a mad little rock pool that uh, goes from like nothing to about three or four foot deep. So look, waves come watch. washing over, it's pretty sick. Ready, look. Ready? So the boys are uh, kind of playing around in here for a bit, I reckon. <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty wild bit of coastline, so at least this bit's protected from having a bit of a swim. So yeah, it's cool. Back from the uh, back from the beach, kids had a ball down there. But how bloody good is this? They're literally a couple of meters from falling off a cliff into the into the ocean. Had two stunning days of weather. A couple of drinks, a couple of little nibbles. Kids inside giving us a piece of quiet. Life is bloody good, just quietly. Hey, anyway, we're going to sit here and enjoy looking at the ocean. It's been a while. And uh, yeah, here's the van. There's the water. Pretty good. All right, we're gonna enjoy this afternoon. Hopefully the clouds burn off a bit and we get a crack of sunset over here, but we'll see. Anyway, first world problems right there. My soul on fire. Tassie mourners are going to get much better than these ones. Woken up to an absolute stunner. Seas are going flat. Sun's out. Tiny little bit of breeze. Ew! Been waiting for these for a while, just quietly. There's a little bit of swell rolling in. I might even be able to bust the board out. Not 100% certain on that, but anyway. I want to go for a dive, but the water, the water seems a bit murky, so I don't know if there's any visitors gonna be achievable down there but anyway plenty of um, abalone and crayfish around here so but i'll just uh knock up some bacon and eggs and whatnot for the morning get the day started and we'll get stuck into this one gonna be a ripper of a day i think about time too because she's been pretty miserable so we've just come down to the beach for the day and we're bringing the big mac down onto the beach for the first time Just like that, we're set up. 
Man, there was so much time, effort and planning went into this buddy, setting this car up to, before we travelled Australia, but moments like these, they make every second of it and every dollar worthwhile. Fam down there, having a swim. Doesn't get much better really. Or, um, this is us for the day. We're just gonna chill out here. Brought lunch down, we brought dive gear, we brought everything. So we're just setting up here and this will be us, but how good. Put on for us here. It has been a cracker of a campsite. Yeah, we uh, couldn't have asked for much more. I think the weather's weather's come out. The beach has been amazing for the kids. Uh, they've had a ball down there, as you see, diving and snorkeling and riding their bodyboards. And yeah, like I said, the weather's just turned mint. It's been a while, but thoroughly enjoyed that. Uh, now we've got to get out of here. She's a uh, Bit of a bit of a track coming in and there's a doozy of little hairpin just up around the bend here that we've got to try to get out so we might drop some footage of that in but yeah well we got down here just so um, yeah, see so, how we get out. Yeah so if you've uh, enjoyed this episode smash that like button and as usual hit the subscribe hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of our future stuff and thanks for tuning in and what a cracker of an episode we got coming up so yeah. stay tuned. Catch you next week. Bye. See you guys.